maybe someone's coming to you with an offer and maybe someone's intimidated by your energy don't get stuck in the thought of people so y'all remember that do not get in don't get in the mindset of being like oh my god i wonder how we'd be that's like a someone was throwing something at you or throwing you know energy at you to see however those who haven't slept with anybody in a while they were trying to throw sex magic on you to see if you were going to go and somebody indirectly don't be knowing that they be doing it if someone thinks about you and they think about you in a sexual manner mm -hmm. Um, maybe someone's, uh, they're recovering from spiritual warfare and you're starting to see this shit coming from out of, you know, an ascension and you see things from a different pair of fresh eyes. Maybe something about the old way of thinking. Maybe someone's learning how to check and control emotions that are not their own. Maybe don't get don't get stuck in the thought of people, like I said, because a relationship sounds good right now, but it's Mercury retrograde. God wants you to focus on your money and doing the inner work and the inner healing. Um, I don't know, y'all. I know I am going to start working on a some a journal or like a journal to help others. It's going to be called Shadow Work Journal or a Shadow Work Journey. I'm still doing some things with it. But um, I'm trying to get that done. However, y'all, I went through my stuff and I did see some cards, y'all. And y'all know, like, something about these cards and how they came out. So I'm getting accommodate. So someone is being accommodated. Gemini's, maybe it's you being accommodated. Maybe you went and you vented to someone and these people are going to help you with your situation. Maybe you've been having people doing prank calls on your phone, playing on your phone. People that had something to do with a situation that was trying to cause a demise for you. Then I'm getting someone is a complete liar. Um, it can also, however, be someone accommodate. When I think about accommodate, I look at accommodations and what does, what accommodates you? Uh, a restaurant, a hotel, a bank, things like that. But somebody was a complete liar towards the situation. Maybe someone's trying to prank call you now, trying to figure out what you know or what you don't know, but you know everything. But like you said, you and like I said, play that chess. Act dumb like they're playing checkers. And when we done, we been on, we was playing chess. Moving forward, all for love. So maybe someone is accommodating you because they see the love in you and they want to give you something back that someone took from you. Life change. Somebody went to someone due to a life change. Five, five, five. Maybe it was a, a lot of mistakes. What I told you, it was a lot of mistakes. It's a lot of mistakes that somebody made and that shit was wrong. They were a complete liar. This complete liar had too many mistakes, mistakes, mistakes to somebody that was in the military. Or maybe this is an army or a military or someone that was a, a it, it was something like that. Maybe something about accommodation. Maybe about army and military. These people got love for you, Gemini's, and these people are going to help you. It was as good as, it, it was as good as. Um, it was a good thing and not a sure thing. So once, so a complete liar, y'all, a complete liar didn't look at a situation for what it was before they followed through or didn't have too much follow through, but it was a good thing, but it wasn't a sure thing. Whatever they were thinking, it was a good thing, but it was not a sure thing. And now everybody getting caught over some, maybe a drug addiction or a karma and, mm, mm, I couldn't even read this card. Now I didn't even see this card. But it was something about a drug addiction as well, y'all. This person that is doing drugs, they're making prank calls. Ooh, my ear started ringing. They're making prank calls. They've been having too many mistakes, too many addictions, or whoever these people are have addictions to drugs. And boy, karma is a bitch. This person that is a complete liar, y'all. They, they're, they're getting karma. They're getting karma because it, it was as good. It was like a good thing. It was a good thing, but it wasn't no sure thing. And now karma's a bitch. That shit coming in. I'm getting something about three or number three or three, 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 or it was three people or it was people working together. 
behind the scenes and you knew but you were trying to wait to get all the answers before you moved accordingly and when you knew what you knew what you saw then you moved accordingly to whatever this situation was um y'all let me get into some more messages because i think i still got some more time on here um i'm getting victory success rewards God delayed to protect your blessings. So God per delayed your blessings so he can protect you from people, places, and things that didn't serve your purpose. Um, I'm getting to God de um, delays your blessings because he knew that it was people around you that was trying to take your money or trying to do something to you or they was going to wait till you got some type of money and then do something weird as far as... Um, Put you in a crazy home or did something and then you would have just been that but see they couldn't do the plan right then because things didn't come in like it was supposed to um i'm getting to y'all uh god delayed to protect your blessing because they was trying to take any and everything that you had and being that you separated yourself they can't do shit then i'm getting you're ready now things um have to be done behind the curtains and scenes so god is going behind the curtains and scenes and your spirit team archangels and the ancestors the higher white light is doing what they need to do to help you so don't doubt nothing then i'm getting long uh where so, I was looking at a tree yesterday, and y'all know when y'all get a tree, and it was just stripped, didn't have no, you know, like you can see like where it started from, like it was stripped, it didn't have no branches, and then some type of way, like the branches started, you know, growing on the tree and stuff like that, almost like Pocahontas, or I don't know, something like that, but I'm getting like someone is going to be made new, or someone's going to be rebuilt, or something is going to be given, or remade or uh a uh, transform I'm getting to um something about you're a 444 you're a valuable person and the spell work is not um it's not working so they're trying to go back into the universe and it's not working like nothing ain't working nothing like they're blocked energy blocked everything blocked and I'm getting, you are visualizing your um, premonitions of your new home. Like, I was doing that. Like, I visualized the home. Like, I, I didn't know where my mind was, but I was really, or I was having one of those moments of seeing something. And I showed, it's like I saw the house. I had saw it being built from the ground up. And it was from my mindset what I wanted it to look like. Um, I'm getting to... Folks did you wrong, worried. They trying to figure out, do you know what you know what you know? And maybe someone's upset with you because you had, they talking about something you lying, but you got facts. That be the shit for me. You upset with me and telling me I'm lying, but I'm the one with the facts and you ain't got none. <laughs> they called you gullible and naive slow, but you checkmate they ass. Yeah. They called you slow, they called you gullible, they called you naive, and you were only playing gullible and naive until you knew what the fuck was going on. And then you split the goddamn script on their ass and showed them that they tell, they ain't dealing with an intelligent ass person. Um, let me say it right, an intelligent ass person. <laughs> um, someone can't value you if they don't know their own value. So if they ain't taking care of their health, how they gonna take care of your goddamn health? They ain't paying your bills. If they can't pay their bills, how they gonna pay their bills? And if they ain't eating right, how they gonna help you eat right? We gotta make our energy make sense. Maybe someone is dealing with a hyper sexual, empty promise keeping ass narc. Let's be honest and love to evolve from our own shortcomings because we somehow um Pretty much, I put it like this. Someone's dealing with somebody that is very hypersexual. And this is trickling in to a situation that's going on that has to do with children. <laughs> oh, yeah, where this tightness coming from? And then I'm getting like someone is uh some someone is dealing with a player. And this player is not safe. 
This person will dip in you, dip in you, dip in you. Maybe he'll take a bath in three days. Dip in you, dip in you, dip in you. And then, 10 on the clock when I said that it's 10 o'clock right now. And then I'm getting folks fear change on your glow up. So people see your change. They see how you move and they see how you eat. And they see that you really just be by yourself. You humble as shit. You know, it, it is things within you that you are changing and needed to be changed, and you changing it. Folks fear change and glow up. Like I said, they fear your change. They fear your glow up. Um, the person that you was dealing with, or maybe you're left behind, or you're finna leave, they carries the spirit of death. Everything they touch dies. Everything. From good relationships to love relationships to be like or you'll get or they'll get money and it never stays. It it, it it just leaves. This person has gives so many illusions, and when they give illusions, it, it just it's just crazy. It's like it's the illusions for me. I call it hocus pocus. They give you a whole bunch of hocus pocus and then they be around here looking all crazy when you done found their ass out and call them on their shit. You know what I'm saying? These people are narcissists as well. Like, like, the god of Anubis don't even like their ass. I'm getting. But moving forward, y'all, um... Maybe someone is recovering or is in recovery and they realize that they was lacking reciprocity in situations. Maybe someone's struggling by financially, but hold on, something's going to happen. Wake up, no, it's not. So maybe some, uh, maybe some, um, maybe someone needs to wake up from a situation. Someone's trying to be like, well, Maybe I need to go back. Maybe they was just playing, bitch, and they was not. Do not go back to that energy. Do not go back to where you were. You're just backtracking if you do. You did all that work just to go to back. Go back. No, we're not going to do that. Um, I'm getting sued. They put you deeper on your spiritual path with God. So pretty much they helped you. They helped you, and honestly, that's what you needed. You just needed that help. To be pushed back to where others try to take you off your path. But y'all, that was y'all message. I thank y'all for y'all likes, y'all shares, y'all subscribes. I'm going to be back on here with some more messages. Because I got a couple couple more pages to do. And I know if I break this down, I'll be able to give y'all the message accordingly. But y'all, until the next one, y'all, peace, love, prosperity, and protection.